Hello YouTube, this is Morgan Airspeed Prime here with my next uh, comic news update video. And basically following on from a couple of weeks ago when we had the news that uh, Turf Wars Part 3 was delayed until August, we have more bad news. And that is that now Team Avatar Tales has been delayed. Uh, this time the delay is from its September, early September release all the way back to um, January 2nd, 2019 here. And this is on the official Dark Horse website. So this is completely uh, the way things are going. Uh, Dark Horse have also confirmed it on Twitter just to make absolutely sure. Um, but this is the situation that we're in now where... Of the next like three books coming out, two of them have now been delayed, and I really wouldn't be surprised if Imbalance Part One gets delayed. I I, I looked it up, and the date is I think uh, the same as we expected. It hasn't been delayed yet, but you know, it's not out. It was the like I suppose last one it kind of expected to be released. So, you know, in a month's time, will it be delayed? I'm not really sure, but. This is such a long delay, especially here, um, September to January, and um, that's that's what that's four months, isn't it? Yeah, September, then uh, October, November, December, January, because it's it's the start of September to the start of January, so it's four whole months. So it's delayed by a third of a year, having just been announced not all that long ago as well, and. Um, and they put out a preview for this as well. So that that's the really, I think, weird thing about this, that they've delayed it after they've already put out some preview pages. Um, this uh, this is just another thing that adds to the list with Dark Horse, where, like, what's going on with the organization on these Avatar and Korra books um, that's causing all of these delays? Turf Wars, you can sort of put aside as a separate thing because uh, Irene Coe's on the book and... Um, her scheduling just seems kind of all over the place. You can maybe justify it that that way, uh, in that that book's just had delays all throughout its run, even before Irene Co was on board. This feels like the one where like it shouldn't have had a delay because like I get you're dealing with so many different creators and stuff like that, but like fundamentally, like again, half of the book. Close to half of the book is just um, reprints, basically. It's just Rebound Shells and Sisters. Um, so you're basically dealing with, like, you just have to get, like, 50 pages, like, put together, more or less. Or, or not even that, like, ju just about 40 or so pages prepared for this book. And they've already put out preview pages. So, like, wh what's the issue here? Um, they don't give any explanation as to why the delay has happened. And again, it's not just like a couple of weeks here. This is like, it's closer to like half of a year than it is just like a, a minor delay. And um, I, this is, I, this is really, I think, disappointing to see. Um, I don't think there's really many ways to sugarcoat this and be like, oh, well, maybe it'll be better because they've had more times. It's just kind of like now, how can we like tr trust Dark Horse's like initial announcements of release dates when they change so much? I really hope that this isn't a trend that's going to continue, where we don't know release dates for books until like, you know, w w we have release dates for books and we just have to abandon them a couple of months in. And um, it's been happening a lot recently, and obviously I've been very critical of how disorganized everything seems. That we're not hearing anything about what's next for Core Comics. We still don't know about that. When's the the Turf Wars hardcover edition going to be announced? And um, I guess it's a little bit early, but you know, Imbalance Part Two covers that sort of thing. Like what's going on there? And obviously, that's the only book like that do hasn't been delayed yet. Is it going to get delayed? This doesn't look well for the comics. Combine that with the news that's sort of gone under the radar because it doesn't affect everyone But that obviously apparently Dark Horse don't have the the licensing rights to sell core comics in the UK and um, And they just randomly revealed that on Twitter when asked about it and um, That they just don't have that 
not like announcing it and making it clear that okay sorry uk fans like we don't have the rights or something like that we're working to fix it it's just no this book isn't available in the uk full stop and um, this is a lot of like negative stuff adding up with dark horse and i don't want to just be like they're the worst thing ever but um the way things have gone the last couple of months like how can we be like overly positive about what's happening here where there when there seems to be so many issues going on with the books um i hope over the comic cons they manage to sort all of this out and we get a much more well organized like end of 2018 and 2019 with releases um because it's been it's it's already been i think too long since the last book came out and you know add to that the fact that like we're still going to be waiting until august for turf wars we're only just about to get into june we're still a long way from that then we were expecting to just get into this kind of like period of like there's here's a f- few books coming out in the next couple of weeks like once we hit august like it's only like two weeks until team avatar tales comes out then it's only a couple of weeks after that until imbalance and then other books will probably be announced now it's what we have a book in august then we potentially wait until october hopefully imbalance doesn't get delayed and then it's january for the next book and le- and pro- more than likely unless there's again delays imbalance part two will probably be scheduled for january or february so like it'll be again having the books very close together and then we don't even know if that'll get delayed so it's it's a very very frustrating thing when i saw this i i was annoyed when i saw this so i'm gonna end the video there what do you guys feel about this I, I feel like I'm being really, really negative towards Dark Horse here, but I almost kind of feel like, how can you not be about this? So I really want to know what you guys feel. Definitely comment. Let me know your thoughts on all these delays. What's happening with Dark Horse uh, the last couple of months with their Avatar and Chorus stuff? Let me know. But uh, yeah, that's been the video. Thanks for watching and bye.